Hi, hello and welcome you all to Mother Teresa Learning Center. So, we have surface chemistry in plus 2 chemistry. We last time the colloids. Stop colloids are introduction and classification. Now, we will talk about the preparation. It is a very important question. Board exam is a neat exam. It is a very important question. How do we prepare a colloid? We have three methods. The first method is dispersion method. The second is condensation method. The third is the by exchanging the solvent in the moon the method order pair the order method pathy on a mother Levi Papa clock mother method pathy in a mechanical dispersion method other can happen on a more colloidal mill at the or colloidal mill number are still are a polar cardi lapoy mao mill mother you come on the so on the mother your colloidal mill at the other seven thousand revolution per minute set pan in set pan it on dina opposite direction on the plate rotate on for example in getting a feed pondering of dina और और एक प्लेट वंदे इंदर साइड रोटेट आगे दबी ना इन्होर प्लेट वंदे इंदर साइड रोटेट आगो सो ऑपोजिट डायरेक्शन ला रोटेट आगे दन आला नम्बर पॉटर पार्टिकल रेड्यूस आई नम्बर कैन ना साइज़ तेवी ओं द साइज़ कैट चरो सो इधर पैर वंदे मैकेनिकल डिस्पोशन बिकॉज़ नम्बर दन काई ला पॉट काई ले ल and second method is electrodispersion This is the first method of the scientist actually Bredig Arc That is modified by Swedberg Because the first method is not the first method of the solvent That is why Swedberg is a non-aqueous solution That is why it is easy to use the liquids We can also say that we can use the electrodispersion That is why we can use the method of Swedberg For example, pentane, benzene That method is also used in electrodispersion and this is the power supply of 1 ampere per 100 volt and the power supply is the same That means you have a metal and vapors come Because the electricity is not the same, the vapors come And the vapors are condensed because there is an ice bath If you have a condensed and cool, it is the solution If you have an example, copper, silver and gold We will prepare the electrode dispersion Next is ultrasonic dispersion In the word layer, ultrasonic Ultrasonic is sound wave there are many sound waves in the audible range There are many high range in the ultrasonic range There are 20 kHz of vibration passed in a particle So if you pass the vibration, what do you think? Automatically, the molecules are disturbed and easy to disperse This is the example of mercury and mercury This is the example of mercury and mercury That is the example of mercury and mercury and peptization is very simple One peptizing agent add Add to it, it is silver chloride If you add hydrochloric acid, it is silver chloride Colloid is very simple process This is called peptizing agent Next is condensation methods In condensation methods, you have two issues One is, you have small particles You have small particles in condensation Two is, you have to prepare a colloid for condensation method Easy precipitation You have to prepare it for the even If you have to prepare it for the even If you have to settle it for the even So that is a problem in condensation methods And here there are five methods in condensation methods This is the first one of the 5R question Oxidation Mostly non-metals are in this method Oxidation Hydroidic acid is react with Hydrogen iodide And you get water and iodine This is the sol here Okay, this is the sol here And reduction of the poem We have gold chloride Reacts with formaldehyde And water You get gold sol Okay, this is gold sol This is all chemical reaction Something will get Any other issue will go away Okay, if you have water eliminated If you have HCl eliminated That's it Okay And next, hydrolysis Mostly when the if you have a hydroxide metal, iron hydroxide, calcium hydroxide, magnesium hydroxide If you have a hydroxide metal, you can see that you have to go hydrolysis Hydrolysis is a lysis breakdown, hydro is a thunny If you have a thunny, it is called hydrolysis Ferric chloride is a thunny, you can see that ferric hydroxide sol SOL, this is a colloid Double decomposition, you can see two decomposition so, this is Arsenius Oxide. Arsenius Oxide, A capital, S small. Arsenius Oxide reacts with Hydrogen Sulfide, both capital. It gives Arsenius Sulfide plus Water. This is Water Insoluble Salts. That is the same thing. We can prepare the double decomposition. And decomposition is the same thing. This is an example. You can add acid. So, you get Sulfur and Water plus Sulfur Dioxide. So, you got Sulfur Sol Okay This is the condensation methods Okay Then by exchange of solvent Solvent exchange is the same For example, phosphorus is the same In a beaker, phosphorus is the same Alcohol is the same Now, who is the solvent? Alcohol If we have a beaker in a beaker If we have a beaker in a beaker 
அது வந்து சால்வ் ஆ மாறிடும் அதான் எக்ஸ்சேஞ்ச் ஆஃப் சால்வென்ட் நம்ம ஆல்கஹால்ல இருந்து வாட்டரா மாத்தணும் இல்லையா அதுதான் எக்ஸ்சேஞ்ச் ஆஃப் சால்வென்ட் சோ இதுதான் மொத்தம் மூணு மெத்தட் இருக்கு உங்களுக்கு ப்ரிப்பரேஷன் ஆஃப் கொலாய்ட்ஸ்ல இத நீங்க இந்த வீடியோ ஃபுல்லா பாத்தீங்க அப்படினா உங்களுக்கு கண்டிப்பா புக்ல போய் படிக்கும் போது இது ரொம்ப ஈஸியாவே இந்த டாபிக் புரியும் அடுத்த கிளாஸ்ல நம்ம பியூரிஃபிகேஷன் ஆஃப் கொலாய்ட்ஸ் பத்தி இன்னும் டீடைலா பார்க்கலாம் இது வரைக்கும் இந்த சேனலை சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணாதவங்க சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணுங்க அண்ட் மறக்காம நோட்டிபிகேஷன் பெல் ஐக்கோனை பிரஸ் பண்ணுங்க இந்த வீடியோ உங்களுக்கு பிடிச்சிருந்தா லைக் பண்ணுங்க உங்களோட ஃப்ரெண்ட்ஸ் எல்லாருக்கும் ஷேர் பண்ணுங்க லேர்னிங் டுடே ஃபார் பெட்டர